Hi, my name is Tim Adams and I'm with Engineered Corrosion Solutions and today we're going to be going through a short uh, commissioning video on our one of our standalone uh, nitrogen generators. This model in particular is our PGEN 30 that has a capacity of 6,500 gallons. At any time you guys get lost during this video, on our uh, door pocket there is a step-by-step -step procedure of what to do when installing and commissioning one of these units. So the first thing you want to do is make sure the cabinet is secured to a uh, secured structure to the floor using the mounting brackets located at the bottom of the generator. The second thing you want to do is make sure your uh, electrical connections coming into the cabinet are uh, stable. So this cabinet requires 120 dedicated circuit. The black goes to L1, which is your hot. The white wire which, or neutral goes in the neutral slot. And the green is your ground goes in the uh, ground slot. Every cabinet comes with standard monitoring points. And these are located on the wiring diagram on the inside of the door. So there's four standard monitoring points. They are power, leak monitoring, bypass, and N2 generation. The bypass means is anytime this unit is bypassed and straight compressed air is introduced into your system, you'll get an alarm. The leak monitoring, this cabinet is designed to run for more than four hours. So if this cabinet runs for more than four hours, you will get an alarm. And anytime this unit kicks on to actually produce nitrogen, you'll get an alarm. The next step is to make sure your nitrogen generator is plumbed to your flashmaker system using a minimum of a half inch diameter pipe. Okay. Lastly, you want to make sure your condensate line from your filters are tied to a dedicated drain, drip cup, or drip pan. If you have any questions, you can contact us at 314-432-1377 or visit our website at ecscorrosion.com.